the end of fall, but it's like spring. Liz! Gotta go get your cat. I'm responsible. We're gonna walk down here for like 14 seconds. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna go out on the pinnacle. And we're gonna sit there and go, Next. And then it's gonna dark, dark, and cold, and we're gonna walk 14 seconds back up the hill. And then go back home. And go home. <laughs> this is not a hike, this is a stroll. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? I'm oh, yeah, good. This chocolate morning I'm gonna fill up water because we ran out last night in the middle of dishes so that was great so I've never showed this process so I should probably do that so this is our gray this is our clean and as you can see that's really this isn't even plumbing this is literally just a pump <laughs> what needs to happen is this needs to come off I cap it because when you take these out, they splash around a lot. So you gotta close it up. So it's a little bit more of a task, but basically uh, the situation and parking spot we're in right now, I need to take this guy and those guys, and I need to walk them to the nearest water source and fill them up. And I need to make that trip two times in order to fill up our six gallon tank. Well, it's a good time. Now I'm gonna wash the dishes. Someone asked, like, wow, you're gonna foot pump that every time you wash dishes? Like, to be honest, it's just gotten used to it. Whenever I go to somebody else's house, I actually sometimes open up the bottom cabinet to look for the foot pump. I moved our pantry up here, so it's actually a lot easier to cook now because before, we were needed getting under our oven in these two baskets that we had to pull out, filled with cans and, and all this like, non perishable stuff. So, really liking this setup right now and cooking is really great ever since like putting in the outdoor kitchen it's amazing so this is our outdoor kitchen it's very primitive but i ordered these lat these um things off amazon they fold down so yeah this is our outdoor kitchen some sesame oil
2021 fall on the ground. No, that's kind of where it belongs. <laughs> we got some cumin, curry, and turmeric. We love this one, paprika. We like spicy things. Got our onion sauteing. So I got some zucchini and mushrooms and onions and garlic. Sweating all that and then we'll put some spices on it. Mmm, look at Charlie. He's like, what you guys doing out there? Hi, Let Charlie. Simmer. Hi, Bubba. Simmer, simmer, simmer. How's your curry? Yummy. Very delicious. So Liz is uh, out right now and she is gonna want something to eat. So she asked, can you make me something quick? And she sent me this really cool recipe that has like brown rice, mushrooms, tomatoes, and spinach. Well, we added the tomatoes and spinach. But right now I have this. Right now I've got uh, some vegetable broth, some mushrooms, basic green ingredients on hand, basically all the time. And that's uh, spinach, mushrooms, tomatoes, and fresh garlic. But these ingredients go literally go with everything. Right now we're parked at our friend's house. Jordan and Lizzie know them. And Lizzie has a salon down here. And that's where Liz is. She's getting ready for a photo shoot today. So I'm gonna take this to her. Don't trip and fall. Featuring Jordan's new steps. Ooh. So we haven't gone, we're not going grocery shopping until tomorrow. And we are basically completely out of food. And Liz is gonna make a concoction of things. I'm trying to figure out what to make for food. Some Starving. We have mushrooms have and rice. we have rice. one box of rice, rice left. Garbanzo we have a beans. small can of garbanzo beans. Dude, tomatoes. No, oh, we got some tomatoes. Okay. All right. Stella. How's it going? Oh, hi. So, this is the result. We got tomatoes beans and mushrooms and spices, some rice and taco shells. We did it. We're not gonna starve. <laughs> we also have these we found we can like dip in case we run out of shells. How was dinner? Is it good? What do you want me to do? Start over? Why well, hello there. Thanks for joining us. I hope you had such a great time. We are having a great time, and we're so glad that you could be here to join us in our journey. You look like you, like on some kind of TV show. Like, <laughs> it's what I'm trying to do. <laughs> right on now. your couch. <laughs> Mr. Rogers. Yeah, you're like Mr. Rogers or something. <laughs> this is Charlie, and he is so happy to be here with you. Right, Charlie? We're so glad that you could join us today in the giving and the sharing. You wanna go? Go. Go. The giving and the sharing, and the sharing and the giving. We just hope that you find a spark in your life which feeds your flame. <laughs> <laughs> and if you haven't, keep searching because that is important to have a important. fire beneath you. We keep striving forward to a better day to have and to hold. <laughs> I would really love it if you would like and subscribe. And press that little bell because unless you press the little bell, you won't get notifications that we put out a new awesome video. Like, subscribe, subscribe. And have a wonderful day. Have a wonderful day. Have a wonderful day.